Hello everyone, it's Lee Bamber again from The Game Creators and this time I want to take a deep dive into the new terrain editing tool. First of all, it should be noted that these are not final visuals. The UI is closer, but we haven't even started on the terrain and the rendering system yet. You'll notice right away the layout is slightly different, specifically the terrain tools panel on the right, which is a convenient location for all of the controls that we'll need when we're editing and painting terrain. So I'll jump straight in with the shape mode. Familiar to people who have used Game Guru Classic, you can go up and down, but now we don't need a keyboard shortcut. We can actually do it through these buttons. You can also change the brush size, so we can have a big brush, or we can have a little brush. And this extends, of course, to paint. So as you can see, we can paint, say, a path. And another mode we have in this terrain painting option is erase. So you don't need to hold down shift. We've now got a specific mode for it. And again, you can have a different brush size and paint something a bit larger or in a different texture. And finally, grass. Now, grass is perhaps the biggest change. I'll show you that now. Instead of a lime green highlight, we can actually paint a shade onto it. And as soon as you let go of the mouse button, you see the grass right inside the editor. So you don't have to go into test game to see it. We can actually change the size of the grass. And you also have the option of changing what the grass looks like. I think we like this one, a nice animating maze style grass and paint some more of that and there's our grass now you may also have noticed in addition to customizing uh, right from inside the editor the vegetation you can also change the sky so we currently got clear we can change that to atmospheric to cartoon to dark golden but we'll set it back to say cloudy and to complete the set we have Customized terrain. So we're currently looking at lush. We can change that to a forest floor. But we'll just set it back to lush for the purposes of this sneak peek video. So the final option, you may have seen that one as well, is weather. So let's select, uh, we can have light rain, heavy rain, light snow, heavy snow. More weather options will be added. For now, we'll just select heavy rain. And because we have display weather ticked, you can actually see the effect of the weather right inside the editor but we can switch that off. So that's a quick look at the Terrain Tools panel. Naturally, this is not the final Terrain system. This is the old Terrain system. We'll be replacing it with a new one, but the controls will be similar to what you see today. And of course, we may be adding some extra controls to this panel as well. So that's the Terrain Editing Controls, and do let us know what you think in the comments below. You can pre-order Game Guru Max in February and save 50%. Check the link in the description below. Join me next time when we take a closer look at path editing. Also, don't forget to subscribe and please do share this video.